I'm Lady Aska and today we want to talk about how you can send your avatar from any app that can send with VMC protocol to Unity. And you may ask yourself, why would I want to do something like that? And the answer is that it means you could use Unity directly using a third-party app like VC Face or Webcam Motion Capture as a middleman application. Which also means you could theoretically do all the things that Unity is capable of with your avatar because you're streaming from within Unity and won't be tied to any plugins beside the Uni VRM plugin. No shader limitations and you could build yourself a whole setup in Unity if you like. A little heads up though before I get you guys too excited. Since this means running multiple programs on your PC, with Unity being one of the big ones eating at your processing power, this is only an option for high-end PC users, which I'm personally not, so I can only show you the basics and you can take it from there. Let's get started. We need three things today, which are a ready-to-go .vrm avatar, a version of Unity and the VMC receiver package. And that's it, because the package will already contain a Uni VRM version that is compatible to work with the receiver package. Links are, as always, down in the description. We create a new Unity project and import the VMC package over Assets, Import Package, Custom Package, and since this will automatically install a version of the Uni VRM plugin, you can, after the import is complete, already start to create a folder and drag your avatar into it. To get it all going, I recommend that you drag your avatar into the hierarchy to the left and adjust the camera that is already in the scene so that it faces your character directly instead of away from it, as it is by default. You can use the movement tools at the top to turn the camera around and place it somewhere in front of your avatar, so that you are in the vision cone of the camera. You can always check that by pressing the play button at the top. This will be the vision you will have of your avatar once we start. Exit play mode and what we have to do now is to add the VMC receiver to our model. To do that, we click on our model's name in the hierarchy, switch to the inspector to the right and scroll all the way down until we see the add component button. We click that one and search for external receiver and add it here. Now that you see this new interface, all you have to do is to drag your model from the left into the big box where it says Model, Root Position Transform and Root Rotation Transform. After that is done, we add another component, this time the OSC Server Script. This is basically where the magic is going to happen. And people who work a lot with OSC VMC receivers and VC Face will already know how this is going to work. You will open now the Sending or the Middleman application, like VC Face, webcam motion capture, or even the VRM posing desktop. Load your avatar into it and write the same port number that these applications are using into this port field in Unity under the OSC server script. Now the moment of truth. We start the sending process from our application and switch over to Unity and press the play button again. I guess it makes sense now that I had you adjust the camera beforehand. Otherwise, you would miss all the action now. And there you go. You could theoretically stream directly from here if you would put a green screen behind your avatar and plug this window into OBS with a chroma key filter. On the other hand, you could also create a complete 3D scene here. Sadly, my PC is not strong enough to actually do that at the moment, but the possibility is definitely there. Not to mention that you can apply your favorite shaders, light sources and animations here and don't have to fight with the export, as you won't export the model further. Once I'm able to upgrade my PC, I will do a follow-up video that shows a bit more of the real potential of this process. I hope this was helpful for our 3D VTuber visionaires out there. I see you guys next time. I hope you have a wonderful day.